Hello everybody, this is Roving Shadow, and we will be finishing up stuff here in Tarna today, and where's my run? There's my run, and actually maybe we'll have someone down here to talk to, perhaps, no of course not, that would be just way too nice, okay, anyways, let's head out here and... Well, I suppose we can go grab the Dispel Potion, because it should be done today. Let's see. Hey, sorry, but I'm just too busy meditating on the meaning of life, the universe, and everything. Just so you know, the answer is 42. After you've found the answer. Um, let's ask about the Dispel Potion. Oh, so I guess it doesn't count that it's been a day, I guess. Okay, never mind. I guess we won't be doing that now. But if we come down this way, I believe we should get stopped by someone we've seen before. Possibly in passing. Um, let's see if it's... Oh. <sighs> Not you. I don't care about your ropes. Um, let's see, so. If we come down here, and then it should be if we. I will hurt you. Honestly, I will. See this water? I will throw you into it. Hector will grab you and just toss you in. Uh, uh, come. <laughs> Okay, so now let's come back this way. It might have to- oh, no, there we go. And look who it is. Hey, you, Blondie, you gotta help me. Listen, I'm begging you. You gotta meet me in this bazaar tonight. I need you to help. Um, let's agree to meet. We agree to meet with the thief. Good, tonight, here in the bazaar, I'll find you. Just don't forget. Okay. I wonder what that was all about. I suppose we should come and meet him tonight then. He did ask nicely and... He must have had a reason to come talk to us. Considering we tossed him... Well, we helped catch him. Um... Honestly, that's pretty much everything we have to do for right now in the village. I mean, er, in Tarna. So what I will do, I will cut here and come back when it is nighttime or there's somebody in here that we can talk to. So, one minute. Okay, I'm back and it should be late enough. Because I believe all the shops are... Yep, yep. There he is. You came. You don't know how glad I am to see you. Just to have someone to talk to. You have no idea how terrible it is to be without honor and Tarna. Um, let's say hello. You greet the thief. You don't know how good it is to hear someone say that to me. Let's ask about these uh, his problems. You gotta help me. What do we have to help you with? Let's ask about being without honor. Big deal, I thought. What kind of punishment is losing honor? I never had much to do with honor anyways. Now I know what they mean when they say without honor. It means no one can talk to me. It means no one even looks at me. It's as if I was dead or something. You're breaking some sort of law just listening to me. Um, then I want to leave. <laughs> I got no place to stay, stay except in the tents of the bazaar at night. No use for money. I can't buy anything. Can't even get away because no caravans are coming because of the war rumors. Um, okay, nothing shows up. Um, let's ask about help. I don't know what to do. I'm starving. The only food I get is some meat that dog guy leaves behind at night. Jeez, it's a good thing it's still warm at night or I'd freeze to death. I heard you was trying to stop the war. Well, I'm not much for politics, 
but go for it. Stop this war. And then the caravans will come back again. And maybe I can get away to some place where they only cut off your hand if they catch you stealing. Only. Let's ask about the thief. Look, call me Harami. Please. I stopped here with the last caravan thinking to pick up a few things here and there and go on my way. How was I supposed to know there was going to be no more caravans coming here? Okay, no big deal. I can make a living for a while. Next thing I, thing I know is I'm caught and they bring up all kinds of things they say I stole. How'd they know? If I knew they saw me in the... If I knew they saw me, I wouldn't have stolen in the first place. Well, obviously. <laughs> um, Tarna. Just want to get as far away from here as I can. Rumors? Rumors talk about war all the time. If you don't say something about peace, I'll never get out of here. Um, well, he did mention that he's starving. And, I mean, we've got a little bit of extra food somewhere. How much food do we have? 36? Yeah. We can spare a few. Thanks, pal. Thanks, pal. Thanks, pal. Thanks, pal. Let's get some on. Oh, that was probably our um, ability to sense danger. Um, what is our um, honor at? I'm curious. And actually, what are all our stats at? Um, honor is at 161. Not bad. Um, how much food do we have left? Because don't want to give all our food away. Oh, 26. We've got a lot. Let's give them a few more pieces. And I will try not to skip. Because we should be able to get the next ability. Because we can get a lot of honor just by giving him food. Um, how much food do we have now? We may not have enough. We have six and five. Um, well, we'll give them one more. Okay. Um, let's say goodbye. Look, take care, huh? I mean, like, you're the only pill I got. I don't want to lose you. Um, okay. Let's leave. Now, I believe we have to come here, like, every night for a few nights. I don't think he'll still be here if we just leave and come back. He might actually. Well, he is. Oh. Oh. I guess he just says the same... Uh, yep. He just says the same thing. Same thing. Okay. Um, we'll give him one more piece of food. Okay. Um... So yeah, we gotta come back here a few nights. Um, let's see if possibly, perhaps, perchance... N nope. No one here that I wanted to see. So... Oh my goodness, the lag. Um... Let's sleep, get our Dispel Potion. Possibly find us a bird. And, um, by the time that happens, it should be getting close to night again. We can come back here, talk to Harami, and, well, do stuff that we need to do with him. And possibly at some point, no, um, possibly at some point, we will also talk to someone here. Um, so first, let's get our Dispel Potion. It will be very, very useful. I've got my things together and made you some nifty Dispel Potions. Great! Um, let's ask about the Dispel. Whatever you want that month. Okay, okay, okay. Um money. Dispel potions. Man, those are expensive. Well, let's just purchase. I'm making these money in time, but what is that measured against happiness? Since you have made my future with Julinar, I give you the gift of the Dispel potions. 
Why, thank you. You are too kind to us. Okay, well, that was nice of him. He just gave it to us, saving us 60 royals, because I think we need two of them. Well, I know for a fact we needed at least one. And why am I going that way? You should have stopped me. Um, so now what we will do, we will go try and find the stupid bird, which should be like right over here or in on the other screen. Should be either or. Oh. Your incredible paladin senses warn you of danger or whatever it said. Because of course I wouldn't do it. And oh my goodness. Stop chasing us. We just... Uh. Come on. Please be short. Because I don't want to just cut. Okay, we got away. Very good. So hopefully we will get this right away. Um... Actually, while we are searching for this, I don't actually believe I really talked about the game itself all that much. So, let's see. Your incredible paladin instincts warn you of approaching danger. Okay, that's all it says. Um, yeah, normally I sort of... Oh, and we're gonna get into a fight. Um, I normally um, sort of talk a little bit about the game before I start it, but I I really didn't do that with this one. Um, stop hitting me. Uh, let's see, what to actually talk about this game? What do I remember? Well, the major thing of this game is that this game was never even planned. This one was sort of um, just tossed in because they sort of needed another adventure for us to go on before we actually get to the next game which at the end of Quest for Glory 2 the original game it would have said Quest for Glory 3 um, Shadows of Darkness which that's not this this is Wages of War and that's because they thought that that game would have been too like dark and too much for us after only going through two adventures. They figured that we needed another. So they sort of tossed this game in between in order to um, give us a little bit more experience. So it sort of shows, it, it really doesn't have the um, level of detail that like the next game has or the ones before. Seems kind of rushed, not the best of mechanics, and my out of wear protection is out of date. Well, well, thank you for telling me that. I will update it later. Um, I don't know if that actually showed up on screen, but if it did, um, that was interesting. So, um, yeah, about the game things. Um, and I actually do hope I'm walk in the right area it... oh this is great this is great th th this this is worth it I just love the music Atten hump Stanley stop excuse me sir but could you tell us the way back to the French Foreign Legion you shake your head to indicate that you have no idea where such a thing might be. Well, Stanley, this is another fine mess you've gotten us into. Hmm, hmm. I'm sorry, Ollie. Oh, just go on. And I, I don't know, I just. I find that great. Didn't those guys look kind of familiar? Yes, they do, and I forget their actual names. Um, if I remember, I will possibly put it in the description of the video. I probably will forget, so. Um, 
I forget the, their whole names. But, um... Oh, where was I? I forgot what I was actually saying when I... Oh. I don't know what that just said. I think I was probably saying I'm getting sleepy. So... Let's sleep till morning. Right in the middle of, of the wild here. Something's probably going to come and eat us. Yep, something's coming to eat us. Okay, um... Yeah, I should have built a fire and... All that. Um, so yes, back to the game. Talking about it and stuff. So yes, this game was not supposed to be... Because the series is supposed to be a... Four series... And each takes place in a compass direction, so, like, in pretty much each game, it was, like, here from the north, from the west, from the east, from the south, because of where we were previously, so. There were each in the compass directions, and, um, let me sleep. Yes, let's make a camp. Um, wow, I just forgot what I, I was in the middle of saying. Um, Alright, so they're each in the four compass directions, and each correspond to a different season. So, like, the first game was the spring, the second game was the summer, the third game is fall, and then the fourth game is, like, the winter. So, this game sort of messed it up because, A, there's not, like, a fifth compass direction, there's not a fifth season, so this one's sort of just completely out of place. This is like an alternate dimension. Like, this is, I don't know. This, it's wrong, that's what it is. Um, yeah, I've, I, I would say this is my least favorite of the game, so. It, I don't know, and oh. And why won't this stupid bird show up. I'm probably in the wrong area. It's probably in the next screen over. Um. It really probably is. And Oh, no! No! No, it was there! It was there! Why did I... Why did I... Why? Why? Could, could someone please tell me? Why did I just do that? Um, I'm gonna go cry. Uh, it, it was right there. Um, and I left it. It was there. And I ran away from it. Um, so I was in the right area. Oh, man. And now I will never be able to get to it again. Come on. <laughs> oh, that is the worst. Like, uh, out of anything that could have happened, that was the absolute worst. Okay. Um, man. I can't believe I just did that. Okay, um... To save you all from now me just clicking around, because I, I don't really think I have much else to talk about concerning the game. Um... At least not that I can think of now. I will, um... Cut and come back when we find the honey bird again. So, one minute. Finally! Bird! No, bird. Bird! That could be a honey bird. Now do we click on the bird or... Um... This is the honey, right? I did buy honey. Yes. Why? Why? Honey. Bird. Why? Crying. 
Um. Um. Oh, honey bird, honey bird. Ah, there we go. Okay, okay. No, no, no. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You see the bees. Killer bees. Oh, I have to. I have to. Um. And that sound is very annoying. Okay. Um. Yeah, that is very, very annoying, and I apologize profusely. Um, come on, come on. Okay, okay. Let's take a rock and throw it at them. Ha ha ha. You bothered the bees. Yeah, so, oh my god. Killer bees. I can't believe you bugged the bees before you. Oh, I, I want to see that message. Before you bother the bumblebees, remember that they can bother you back. Okay. I, I just kind of enjoy that. Um, do we use the honey on them? Honey on the ground here? Ah, uh, yes. Honey on the ground here. Now we may leave. And there we go. That's interesting. Very, very interesting. So now we go back to it. And... The bird looks like it enjoys wallowing the honey. So let's walk over to it, and it flies away. Leaving behind a stupid feather that took us forever to get. Okay, now we never have to worry about that again. And we can go back to Tarna. And it will definitely be nighttime by the time we get back. Hopefully it's not too late. Um Oh yeah, it is late. It, you sense that there's danger nearby. There's no danger. We've already taken care of this. I just want to go back to Tarna. I want I... I just want to go home. Um. Oh, come on. No, I, I just... I, we're right there. I can, I can see it in the distance. And it's a stupid ant. Um. We'll go talk to Harami. He should be around. And hopefully that, um... Person I'm trying to wait and talk to two will show up at some point in time while we are still in the area but I know he won't was it a she or I can't remember the person them they um, and then we'll give the feather to Salim and head off somewhere I, I should have got food I never thought I'd be glad to see someone who helped me get caught, but man, am I glad to see me. You gotta help. Um, let's greet him. Let's tell about mission. Trying to bring him came all the way to this weird place to help a lion bring peace. What a way for anyone to make a living. You gotta look out for number one to get anywhere in this world. Yeah, you gotta help me. Um, let's ask about help. Just having someone talk to actually. Okay. Um, let's ask about Harami. Don't know how long I can stand this. I mean, never had much to do with people before. Kept up to myself, you know. Now you say hi to me, and I feel like I ought to kiss your hand or something. Just to have someone say something to me is good. It is good to have human interaction, talking to people. Um. Okay. Um. Oh man, I don't have any more food really to just give. Eh. You know what? Tomorrow we will get. We'll buy some food. 
Ah, uh, okay. Um, goodbye. Okay, let's go sleep. And then I suppose I will call that f for this video, because I sort of um, spent a lot of time just walking around looking for that stupid bird, which should now die in a fire. A hot fire. A very, very hot fire. Um, so, yeah, I will call it here. Next time we will give the feather to Salim. Hopefully talk to the person I'm waiting for, who will probably not show up. And, um... Finish up talking to Harami, and then we will pretty much be done with Tarna. Like, we're actually getting a little bit close to the end of the game. I mean, it's not that long of a game, so... I will see you all next time.